Today, let's break down and remake Fever by Julipa and Angel. 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 Angeli. Angela. Am I saying that right? Anyway, it's a sick song. Sick. With some of the most lush backing vocals I've heard in a while. Shout out to Dancing Pineapple and Burfin for suggesting this track. Those two are some real OGs of the channel. Although, to be honest, all of you watching this video right now are OGs, so shout out to you guys. Aww. If you enjoyed this video, or maybe even learned something from it, feel free to hit the like and subscribe button. It really does help the channel out. And if you want to see these breakdowns in more detail, Twitch is the place to go. I stream over there once a week at the minute, and I can answer any of your questions in full detail over there. So that's the place to go. Links down below. All right, let's get into it. Let's get under the covers with Fever by Julipa and Angel. Angel. Angel? Here we go! Today, Julipa, this week on the X Factor. Julipa brings back the feverish nights with her song, Fever. Anyway, here we go. Straight into it. Title. You can see last week was Therefore I Am. Great song by Billie Eilish. You can check that out on YouTube. Link above. All right, title. Fever. In the color. That's a tough one. Purple. Seems about right. Let's get some instruments. Okay, so we're going to need to get a key. We're going to need chords. And we're going to need BPM. Let's have a listen to the track and try and play along. Tell me what you're going to do right now. Tell me what you're doing right now. Yeah, it's a nice combination. We've got two minors, two majors. Those chords are F sharp minor, E major, B minor, and followed by D major. Key, F sharp minor, BPM, you know the drill. Let's get our metronome, click along to the track, and we'll see what it is. BRB. 12 seconds later. Tell me what you want to do right now. 115. 115. Instruments. We've got a synthy guy. He happens at the beginning. He's nice. Bass of some sort just hitting the downbeats. That's keeping it nice and warm. We've got lots of drums, but the drums are pretty straightforward today. Nothing too crazy. But the most important thing about the drums is we have a soca beat. Yes. Soca beats for days. Yeah. One, two, and three, four. Ba, ba, ba. Bah. Does that make sense? Strings. Strings. Pizzicato. Impacts and risers. Goes without saying. We've got a lovely texture, which is by like a vocal sound. <laughs> I'll probably use output for that. Lead vocal. <laughs> you know the drill. Double. Vocal. Lovely BVs out wide. They're like really thick. Like they're wide and they're not in the center at all. But anyway, her beautiful v BVs are insane. They're just so wide. Mmm. Tasty. Would recommend a listen. So let's start off with that cool synth because that pretty much holds down the track. And once we get that, then we can go from there. And then we're feeling vibe at the door. I I'm thinking retro synth could be nice for this guy. So let's open up a software instrument. We'll call him synth three. Okay, well we have some sort of line. Let's just record it in and see how it goes. <laughs> okay, that was miles off, but we were at least getting something relatively close so we can work from there. Okay, there's our four chords that we're kind of using as loops. And then I think it's 16 bars in total. <laughs> That's a nice synth line. I'm very impressed. Cool. All right. Okay. So we're on drums. Let's find a kick. I'm going to rob this kick from the last day because I like the count. He's a really nice guy. So there's our four to the floor. One, two, three, four. Glorious. Okay. So there's snares and claps happening on the two and four. And then there's the extra soca beat in between those. Let's grab our snares. So it's a nice thuddy, thuddy snare. So we're going to go to splice for everything nice. Okay. So we're throwing in two sounds. We want the count. Lovely. We love the count. He's the man. He's going in on the two and the four. And we also want a thud guy. I have a thud guy from before this TS cinematic pop. Ooh, that thud. All right. And let's just use our marquee tool to copy them across right on every two. Okay, so we copy them across there on the two and the four. Band order to copy across. Great. Beautiful. Mmm, tasty. Great. Now let's have a look at our snoka hit. What does that sound like? We have a nice thud, nice gentle thud hitting the... Mm, chat. Cha, hitting the cha-chas. <laughs> no, they don't sound like cha-chas. And then we also have on the two and the four. Ch ch What's happening on the thuds, the snares, the two and the fours, we have a wide clap clicks that are happening alongside it. That's differentiated because it's a little bit wider on those beats. So let's actually grab something from before. Let's see how it sounds. Copy across. Let's have a listen to this kind of zone. Ooh, wow. Bit too big, I think. What if it was short and I'm really short? Ooh, that could work. Cool. Maybe let's just tidy up the high end because there's a lot of hiss. Cool. Maybe just a little bit less low end. Nice. So let's copy that across. Mm, yes. Okay, a few more sounds over there. Let's just add in some of those clicks then on the outside that we were talking about there. So it's basically on the two and the four, there's just nice clicks that are panned. One's on the left, one's on the right, and just mm, tasty. Very tasty. We need to find a nice click. Nice clickety click click. I like that percussion guy. So he's on the two and the four and he's out wide. Cool, so let's copy him across. One left, one right. 
Nice. Turn that way down and then copy across. Command or. Okay, I'm pretty happy with that. There's definitely some hi-hats and stuff going, so let's have a listen to them. One. Let's try to find that hi-hat. I'll rob the sound here from before. <laughs> you saw you're coming with me. All right, so he comes in in a second here. So it's one, cha-cha, two, cha-cha. So if we copy this guy, this bar is gonna be copied. I'm gonna double this hi-hat. So we've panned one to the left and one to the right. So I've just heard one more thing. It's just like an open guy and shh, shh, open high. Kind of a shaker sound just on that open, openness. <laughs> you know what I mean? Ooh, this guy's kind of nice. And we'll just turn him down. So he's just going syncopated to the kick, really. You know, that kind of way. You know, that way. There's our shaker in. Beautiful. Nah. Okay, so when we get to this section, I think it changes. And what happens is, I think it goes to violins, actually. And maybe gets rid of the start of each of them. So let's have a listen to those. <laughs> that sounds pretty cool. Cool. And then we have the bass comes in here as well. We got this. <laughs> Promise. Let's try and record it in. Okay, so I think that's what the bass does. It's got a nice rhythm. This is sounding nice. Okay, what else do we have? What are we missing? Cool. All right, so next we need to get in our texture, the vocals, the thing from output, because it's my good friend. And it always works well. Exhale. Let's jump to this guy. And there's a preset that's never really too far off. So let's just find that guy. Click into it. Get rid of this. Number seven, I think. Merfunk. Merfunk. And then we'll put a side chain on that, and then we'll be bouncing and we'll be good. Let's try and record that in. Let me just quantize that to make sure they start at the right place. And then we'll fix the velocity because I just want that to be controlled. Exhale, doing our lovely sounds. Synth, bass, drums, strings, impacts and risers. Impacts and risers. Impacts and risers. Coming to a cinema near you. So we've got white noise riser. Sounds like this. Nice. And I've just got a basic level of white noise happening the whole time. Just to kind of, you know, fill in, fill in some sound. Got a big impact. He comes in on the downbeat. That's huge. And we've also got a swell, which is basically the crash on top of that. And all together, those sound like this. Nice. Just going to give us a bit more bounce. So let's just have a listen to that one. Is. Vocals. Sing some songs. Preferably this one. Cool. Let's give it a go. Press or to record. Got a fever. Can you check? And on my forehead. Kiss my neck. And when you touch me, baby, I turn red. I've got the fever, so can you check? Tell me what you wanna do right I might have to record these separately because I can't think. As, as you know, we'll probably use that as a double just because first takes are not our last. Let me sing this again. Lead vocal. I've got a fever, can you check? Hand on my forehead, kiss my neck. <laughs> Let's try and do the second half. Tell me what you wanna do right now, because I don't really wanna cool it down. Cool, we're on the upbeat there, lovey. Okay, we got this, we got this, we got this. Tell me what you wanna do right now, tell me what you wanna do right now. Tell me what you wanna do right now, because I don't really wanna cool it down. Yes! Sweet, we got it finally. Finally. Okay, that's our double. One more time. Tell me what you wanna do right now, tell me what you wanna do right now. And then let's see if I can sing your lead vocal now that I've actually listened to it a few times. It's gotta be the lead, surely. This time. I've got a fever, can you check? Okay, BVs, I'm saying some French things that I don't understand what it means, but we're going for it. Amour en frère. <laughs> it sounds like I'm saying love of the brother, but it's not that. Oh, love of the fever. Oh, okay. Cool, that's one. He's gonna be nice and gentle and panned out wide. We just have to have him in tune. Okay, let's try up the octave. Sorry, it's so high. Oh, there's a harmony there. Let me mute the lead for a second. Nice, nice, nice. Simple and sweet. There's a lot of vocals there, but they sound kind of cool. I hope. Let's have a listen to the full thing. It would be rude not to. Here we go. This is Fever by Julie but and Angers. I hope you enjoy. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. I've got a fever, can you check? And on my forehead, kiss my neck And when you touch me, baby, I turn red I've got a fever, so can you check? Tell me what you wanna do right now, tell me what you wanna do right now Tell me what you wanna do right now 
wanna do right now Cause I don't really wanna cool it down Tell me what you wanna do right now Tell me what you wanna do right now Tell me what you wanna do right now Cause I don't really wanna cool it down Okay, so we're struggling a little bit, but we're getting there, right? <laughs> uh.